it's Charlotte here and for today's video I'm finally going to be doing my Lush collection. I'm so pumped for this video. I'm just like yes Lush collection let's do this. I love Lush and I have a ridiculous amount of it. If you have not seen my previous Boxing Day hauls or any of my many Lush hauls on this channel I will love Lush and I have this storage behind me. These drawers are mainly full of Lush which is really bad but you know Lush is just something that accumulates really quickly I don't know where I'm going with this sentence I just have a lot of Lush this video has been so highly requested so I thought you guys would really enjoy this video I just want to tell you guys that I'm 150,000% not trying to brag about this video whatsoever I love giving my viewers videos that they really want to see and since this video has been super duper requested I thought you guys might be interested in seeing what's in my Lush collection and let me tell you this right now this collection has not accumulated overnight over a day over a month over a week over a year I've been collecting since around 2014 which is two years ago and I usually buy all of my Lush on Boxing Day, so when everything is 50% off. So I don't usually pay full price for an item unless it's like from a collection. Like the Mother's Day that just came out and the Easter collection. So I don't have a lot of the normal collection. And I know the Lush has a used by date and does expire. But I know I do have some things that are from like last year. But I try to use those things first. And it's hard to have a bath like every single night to use all of them up. So... I know that they sometimes expire so you don't need to tell me in the comments because I know so please remember before thinking about making a nasty comment in the comments down below because there's no bragging here yes so let's I'm so excited for this video let's just get started into this collection I'm so pumped I hope you guys enjoy it Mwah, let's go so right here we have what my Lush is stored in they are the Alex 4 drawers from Ikea and on top I just have some plants and a picture and then I have my mirror next to it. So I have the first three drawers I think are full of Lush. So we're going to dive into it. I actually forgot to film this first which I need to do. So I'm putting this at the front of the video just to show you guys. So down here I have some products that I have to use up first before I'm allowed to touch anything in there. So in here I just have a bunch of older products that I have to use up and I have the little Christmas hedgehog that I've been saving because I just don't want to use it. Too cute. And they didn't bring him back last year and he smells awesome and I love him. And then in here, oh sorry about that one. I just have some products like Heartthrob, Big Blue, Tisty, Toasty, Pop in the Bath, some Bright Side, just a bunch of things that I have not used yet and I need to do that. Here is the first drawer and when you open it up, this is what it looks like. So right here I have the Snow Fray box, and that was from 2014. And in here I just have Luxury Lush Puds. That name always gets me tongue tied but it smells so good. Very like spicy and Christmassy. I love that bath bomb. And then in here I just have another gift set. And in here I just have some bubble bars. I have the green bubble rune, pop in the bath. I have a Yolknog bath bomb down there. A Dorothy, the Christmas one. Holly Lightly, just a bunch of bath bombs and mainly bubble bars. But mainly bubble bars. Pop that back in. This is going to be such a hassle putting them all back in. And then right here we have the Stardust gift box. And in here I have the Stardust bath bombs. <laughs> I have a lot of the Stardust bath bombs. They smell awesome. So I have I think about six of these. They smell just really creamy. I love that one. And I have a comforter, a few of the Candy Mountains and two shoot for the stars. So yeah, that's what's in there. When you move along, I just have some shower gels and some other things. I have a first snow, lots of snow fairies, snow fairy, all that fairy dust, Lord of Misrule, Ro the Comforter Shower Cream, Rose Jam, and a Sweetie Pie Shower Jelly. So right here, I have a bunch of the Intergalactic Bath Bombs. I got these in sets at Christmas, and it just smells really minty. I love that one. And it looks awesome in the bath. And then I have a few of the experimenters, which they just brought out in stores. So you can buy those in stores now. And then up here, I have a magic wand bubble bar and two of these 
What are these called? I've forgotten what these are called, but they smell really good. They smell like cinnamon. And then, if you go here, I have a, I think it was the first snow gift box. How am I going to do this? This is going to be really tough. In here, I have the golden rings, a Lord of Misrule, and four of the golden wonder bath bombs. And then in here, I have some more bath bombs. I have three of the cinders, some dashing Santas, and then normal Santas. And then in the back one, these are the Butterbear gift set tins. I have Butterbear bath bombs, which smell awesome. I love Butterbear. They smell like butter, and they're really cool, and I love them. So that is everything in the first drawer. And now we're going to move on to the second drawer. I'm sorry if this is like constantly out of focus. Second drawer. So right here I have all of my soaps. I have a lot of soaps. I really need to use them. So I have my favourite. Oh no, this is snow cake. This is my favourite. My favourite is Yognog. Oh my gosh. It smells absolutely amazing. And then I just have other ones. I have Bohemian there. Fairy. Is it Fairy? No. I've, um, I baked Alaska, that's what it's called. Some more yognog, some porridge, I think that's called. Porridge? I can't remember. I have a Snow Fairy Sparkle Massage Bar, a cute little whale soap from Lush, and then some Godmother soap, which smells awesome. And then if you move across, I have the new... Where is that? The new Ladybird Bubble Bar from the Mother's Day Collection and the Flowering Tea Bag from the Mother's Day Collection. And I also have Golden Egg and Phoenix Rising Bath Bomb. And then I also have these, uh, the Witch Came First, which smells amazing. And then the Humpty Dumpty, which all smell awesome. And then in here I have this. Oh, some crushed up um, Granny Takes a Dip. So if we open this up... Jingle Bells old gift set. I have more Christmas bath bombs. I have a few of the butter balls. These aren't Christmas, but they're just in there. And then I have the. Oh, I forgot that all these names. These are all from last year. But then I also have the sparkly pumpkin, Yognog, which is my favourite, um, Lord of Misrule, and some Cinders, and then Golden Wonders and. Dashing Santas, I believe. So yeah, they're all in there, and they're just a bunch of random ones. But they all smell really good, and I really like them all. Back on. This always gets me putting this one back on. Here is the old Star of Wonder. I have more. I have Snow Angel Bath Melts. I'm so sorry if this is out of focus. Xmas Kisses, which was a limited edition in the Christmas of July. So I only think that came out in Australia, which is cool. And then I have some Think Pink, Bahumbug, um, Holigo Lightly, and then So White, which I only got one So White, which is really annoying because it smells awesome. And just like Twilight and just normal collection things. And then Secret Garden, I remember that, it was from last year. But yeah, that's all in there. Then going down here, I just have a Flamingo, and I have milk bottle and two unicorn horns and the lover's lamp and what's also down here um granny takes a dip bubble bar and just a rose gem and then there's another little one down there that i can't remember but yeah that's all in there that's just like randomly sitting on the side oh my gosh this is so hard i'm like struggling to breathe right now and then over here i have some um normal collection ones for a change i think it's rising the middle of Granny Takes a Dip Bath Bomb, my favourite fizz bangers, and then I just have um, a fluffy egg from last, from this year? Yeah. Avro Bath, Big Blue, Twilight. And they are just in there. And then going into here, I just have all my lip things. I don't have very many lip products from last. I have just a few lip scrubs and random lip balms in there. And then in here, I just have more random things. Use You and Coco, Comforter, Creamy Candy, Rose Jam. Filming this video, guys. It's really hard. And I'm getting really tired really fast. Okay, moving on back to here. I'm just like bending down. I have the bright side, the little robot, blue skies, fluffy white clouds, and a sunny side. And then back there, I just have an avro bath and a 
Amo Pondo. And that's everything in here. The last drawer is a little bit of a mess. I'm just going to squat down for this one. In here, I just have like so many random things. I have a Dream Steam and then I also have a Rose Bombshell. Okay, and then here I have a few samples. I actually have a lot of samples of just, just random products. More samples, more samples, more samples. But then I just have Rub Rub Rub, Snow Showers, a lot of their jellies, Nightwing, Santa's Belly, Refresher. Um, more samples. And then I have the little delights, some fun. The Bouncing Bunny Shower Jelly, like the Sugar Scrub, some Honey I Watch the Kids, First Snow, Tea Tree, what's in here? Hot Toddy from 2014. I hate that one. <laughs> it honestly smells really bad. Um, the Carrots, which get so messy, and just lots of bubble bars and fun. I don't really use fun. Fun annoys me. <laughs> But yeah, I have some fun. But this one smells really good. The pink fun. It smells like cotton candy. And I really like that one. So yeah, that is everything in that drawer. So that is everything for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my Lush collection. And I hope it fulfilled your expectations. Woo! I know I'm bound to get Alice's. I'm just going to quickly tell you what type of plants these are. And I got that from Target, by the way. So up here, I'm just going to tell you quickly because I know someone's going to ask. Aloe vera. I think this is a burrow's tail. I have a sunrise jade. Just a succulent. I think it's like an echeveria. I can't remember. A cactus. Don't know what that is. That's like a ro roeo. This is a weird type of peace lily. And this, I think this is like a whole wall. There's a brown or something. But yeah, it's really cute. So yeah, that's everything on top of there. And this greenhouse is from Ikea. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up if you did. And subscribe if you haven't already. I hope that my last collection fulfilled all your expectations. Because I know a lot of you guys have been wanting to see it so badly. So here it finally is. And I'm really happy that I finally filled this video. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I love you all so, so, so much. And I will see you in my next video. Mwah. I love you guys. Bye. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-